morning everybody. Well, just on the way to the post office to uh, take my alternator back. Ordered an alternator for a Saab turbo diesel off of eBay. In the description it says working perfectly, test uh, tried and tested. Uh, 39 pound free postage. Yep, I'll try that one. Got it. Took three days to come. So we were at the car for three or four days. So we got it. Worked out how to put it on, which wasn't very easy. If, you, if anybody's changed an alternator on a Saab, they'll know what I mean. It's not the easiest job in the world. Yes, it wasn't the uh, easiest job in the world. Forgot where I was now. Totally sidetracked as normal. Doesn't take a lot for me, you know. Especially at my age. Yes, the Saab alternator. Yes, sir, I worked out how to do it. I did it. It took about three hours. All in all, to get it off and on. And then what happened? It was fine for the first few seconds and then the warning light came back up on the dash. Please go to services immediately. Battery not charging. Oh my god. So I got out of the car, left it running, went to the other side of the car, undone the live terminal on the battery, took it off and what happened? The car just stalled straight away. I don't know if you guys know, but on a car, if your battery's not charging and you don't know whether it's the battery or the alternator, all you have to do is undo your red wire on the battery while the engine is running, pull it off the battery. If the car keeps running, the alternator is fine. If the car stops, it's definitely the alternator. Believe me. And the car stopped and I thought, oh my god. And then I thought, hang on, this is a diesel car. Is it the same with diesels? Have I done something wrong or is there something else wrong? Is there a broken wire somewhere? You know what I mean? You start doubting yourself. Anyway, I mentioned message to the bloke. Uh, Battery's still not charging, mate, with your new alternator. Any ideas? Uh, no, sorry, mate. <coughs> Hello. Smile. <coughs> God, I'm only doing 28. You wait till I come back, mate. Yeah, so uh, we ordered another one. I think it was from F1 Spears. Got a message from them. Yes, we've got one. Uh, yes, it's for that model. Yes, we'll have it then. And then halfway through the day, they sent us a photo through the email. Just to make sure, is this the right one? No, it's not the right one. It's totally different. Oh, can you send us a picture of your one? Okay. Oh yes, we've got that one in stock. But we won't be able to post it now until Friday. Hopefully you'll get it Saturday, definitely on Monday. Okay, we'll have that one. And this is like now nearly three weeks without a car. So Monday comes, we're waiting for the postman. And uh, at the end of the day, you'll get a text. Hey, we have got your parcel, it will be here tomorrow which is then Tuesday and it's pissing it down with rain anyway three o'clock Tuesday it came 
On Wednesday, the wife's got to go to London to help her mother out. So what did I have to do? Yes, I had to put all my waterproofs on, go outside in the pouring down rain, and fit this other alternator. I guess for, I'm quite an expert on fitting alternators on Saab's now, so if anybody wants one doing, I'll do it for 50 quid. <laughs> no, not really. But I'm quite an expert. We like that to an hour. I took that one off, put that one on, and it only took me an hour. I started it up, it really seems alright. I went over to the battery, disconnected the wire, and the car kept running. So what did I do? I did a rain dance around the car. Yes! Yes! So now I am returning this one. And I wonder how much that's gonna cost. Hello, mister. How you doing? Don't worry about me. So we'll park here, shall we? The post office is over there somewhere. Do -do -do -do. And there is my alternator. It looks big, doesn't it? it? Looks bloody massive. Of course, it's just bloody heavy. Ooh, that was nice and simple. Normally takes you two hours to cross the road. Are you going out? Oh, no, I'm going to wait. Okay. Let's pop that on there, it's quite heavy. Yeah. <laughs> Ah. <laughs> Got portable hotels. Right, <laughs> one there for me. One receipt. Okay, thank you. Oh, that was painless. Didn't cost me a penny. I was expecting to pay for that. Oh, run for it. Let's carry on with the ride. Where shall we go? Is if you enjoy my videos, please make sure you leave a thumbs up. Because all the thumbs up, the more thumbs up I get, the more my video gets shown around YouTube. So if you enjoy my video, please leave a thumbs up. And if you don't enjoy my video, leave a thumbs down. They all can't. Anyway. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Me taking my alternator to the post office. <laughs> and I'll see you again soon. What, you still there? You still there watching? How can I finish the video if you keep watching? It's time to go. Oh, come on, I can't finish the video if you stop there. Hello. <laughs> Little fatty. Oh, come on. I want to finish the video. I can't. Just go. Go, go. Seriously, come on. Just go. Look, I can't be ignorant and finish the video while you're still there, can I? Just, just turn, just, you know, put your thumbs up and go.
and subscribe if you haven't already. Are you still there? You are, are you? Are you still there? Oh my god. Alright then, I'll put some music on for you. Okay? Here's some music. And I'll see you again soon. Bye! Come uh on. -huh.